Good morning students. How are you all? I hope you all will be fine at your home. Today we are going to start with very important and interesting topic that is the verbs. Do you know what are verbs? Do you know that? Now let us see. Doing words or action words are the verbs. What are doing words and action words? They are the actions which we perform in day to day routine. Like the words that sit, stand, learn, see. These are the action words which we perform in day to day routine. Let's see through an example. First picture is what is the girl doing? She is running. So here she is performing some action. So the doing word or the action word is run. Verb is R U N run. In the next picture, what is the boy doing? He is clapping. So he is performing some action. So here the verb is clap. C L A P clap. What is the boy doing here? He is sleeping. So here the verb is sleep. S L W E P sleep. What is the boy doing here? He is watching cartoon on a TV. So here the verb is watch. W A T C H watch. In the next picture, what is the boy eating? He is doing some work. Here the verb is eat. E A T eat. In the next picture, what is the boy doing? He is performing some action. Yeah, he is reading. R E A D read, which is a verb. In the next picture, see boys, what is the girl doing? She is writing. W R I T E. The verb is write. So children, what the girl is doing? She is writing, which is a doing word or a verb. What is the boy doing here? See boys, he is drinking milk. So here the action word is drink. So here the verb is D R I N K. Drink. In the next picture, what is the girl doing? She is singing. So here she is performing some action, and the verb is sing. S I N G, sing. In the next picture, what is the boy doing? He is listening to music. So here, the verb is listen. L I S T E N, listen. What is the girl doing here? She is sitting. She is performing some action. The verb is sit. S I T sit. In the next picture, what is the boy doing? It's opposite of sit. Stand. Yes, the verb is stand. He is performing some action. That is stand. In the next picture, wow. What are the children doing? They are dancing. So they are performing some action. The verb here is dance. D A N C E, dance. Wow! What is the girl doing here? She is walking. Do you know, children? Walking is good for health. So the verb here is walk. W A L K, walk. Wow! What are the children doing here? They are learning. So they are performing some action, doing some action. So the verb here is learn. L E A R N, learn. Here, what are the birds doing? Yes, they are flying. So here, the verb is fly. Yes, it is fly. So here children we have seen in the different pictures different doing words or action words are being seen so the verb is basically the name of the action or the do doing which you are performing at that particular time 
Without a right verb, the sentence is incomplete. Yes, verb is a main pillar in the sentence. Now let's go to the definition of the verb. A verb is a word which says what a person or a thing does. I repeat once again. A verb is a word which says what a person or a thing does. The examples are Sam reads a book. Here, what is Sam doing? He is reading the book. So, the verb is reads. In the second sentence, I eat mango. What I am doing with mango? I am eating it. So, the verb here is eat. She dances well. What is she doing? She is performing some action. She is dancing. So, here the verb is dances. In all, there are also helping verbs which we can see. That is, is, am, are, was, were, has, have, had, shall, will, must, can, may, has been, have been. These are the helping verbs which come before the main verb. So let's see the examples. She will come tomorrow. Here, will is the helping verb and come is the main verb. But when they are together, they both are verbs. Secondly, Anil was playing. Here, was is a helping verb and playing is the main verb. So here, Anil was playing, was playing considered as verb. Now children, take out this book of yours and come to page number 17. We'll do the exercises. See, question number first. Pick out the verbs in the following sentences. The first question is, the girl sings sweetly. So what is the verb here? Sings. Underline with me. Sings. Secondly, the boy stood on the burning deck. What is the verb here? Stood. As the boy is performing some action. Which is stood. Cocks crow in the morning. What are cocks doing? What is the action here? Crow is this sound. The answer is crow. Fourth, cat seen the dark. What is the action? What is the verb? See. Now, fifth part is the boy fell in water. What is the action performed by the boy? Fell. Underline fell. I met a little cottage girl. What is the verb here? Met. Please underline met. Little Jack Horner sat in a corner. What is the action performed by the boy? What is the verb here? Sat. The picture hangs on the wall. What is the verb here? Hands. Very good. Hands. We like cricket better than football. What is the verb here? What is the action we are performing? We are liking some cricket. So here we have to underline like. Little Bo Peep lost her sheep. So what is the action little Bo Peep performing? She has lost her sheep. So here the verb is lost. Underline it. The foolish crow tried to sing. What does the foolish crow Doing, he tried to sing. He has performed the action. Tried. Underline try. The old woman lives all alone. The old woman lives all alone. Here the verb is lives. I hope you understand this question. Now come to the second part of the question. 
Here we have to pick out the verbs in the following sentences but the different is that there are helping verbs with the main verbs The first part is we have learnt our lessons here we have to underline two words have and learnt because have is the helping verb and learnt is the main verb so we have to underline both second part he will do the sums in an hour similarly we have to underline will do in the third part i am writing in my copy book so here we have to underline both the verbs am writing fourth part i shall be leaving next week so here we have to underline both the verbs shall be leaving in the fifth part rama can bowl fast So here the helping verb is can and bowl is the main verb but we have to underline both of them sixth part we must rise early so here we have to underline both of them must rise in the seventh part we have the shops were closed yesterday so here the helping verb is were, were and the main verb is closed so we have to underline were closed children should obey their parents so here the helping verb is should and the main verb is obey so we have to underline both of them should obey ninth part you may eat this mango so here we have to underline both of them may eat tenth part i had finished when he came so here there are two answers firstly the helping word ha had and the main verb finished along with that he also perform another action which is a verb came so here we have to underline three things had finished and came similarly in 11th part we have to underline it was raining when he came out here the first verb is was raining and the second part is came so we have to underline both of them 12th part the baby was drinking milk when we entered the room similarly again there are two answers that is was drinking and entered as two actions are performed 13th part they have been playing cricket all afternoon so here students the helping word is have been and the main verb is playing so here the answer is have been playing i hope you understood both the questions now come to the last part here in page number 18 the last question is fill up the options are given to you and you have to fill the correct answer so let's move on first one is he dash a large family now look at this what will come with he he has a large family the next part a tortoise dash slowly what does the tortoise do look at the options so here moves is the answer very good the tortoise moves slowly next part the sun dash in the west do you know how, what does this mean what is the options here the sun rises in the east but what does it do in the west very good it sets in the west the sun sets in the west fourth part children usually dash ice creams what does the children do with the ice creams i think you all like it very good the answer is like 
In the next part, fifth part, the next is V dash in the river. What do we do in the river? V swam in the river. We swam in the river. I dash some photos with my new camera. What do I do with the photos? I took. I took some photos with my new camera. She dash the plants every day. What does she do with the plants every day? She waters the plants every day. Very good. She waters the plants every day. We dash a pen for writing. What do we do with the pen? We use the pen for writing. The kite dash high. What did the kite do? The kite flew high. The kite flew high. India dash the match. What did India do the match? India, look at the options. Won the match. Okay. Eleventh part. He dashed to the cassettes. What do he do to the cassettes? Children, what do you do to the cassettes? You listen to them. Very right. He listened to the cassettes. Twelfth and the last part. A parrot dash a lovely bird. Parrot is one thing. So with one we will put is. In the option there is a C. A parrot is a lovely bird. So children, these are two. The exercises and we are done with all of it. I hope you understand the session of today. That is the verbs which is the very important session. I hope you like this session. Thank you very much.